Hello YouTube, thought we'd do a quick video here. I'm going to show you how to get the free uh, weather report on your GMRS Tweet Radio repeater. The software is free. It's the same software that I did, I had did a video on for time. And you can unselect time if you don't want the time. Or you can have time and the weather. It will say the time first, then it will say the weather after. So if you don't want the time, then you just unselect these this, these time checks. Now this weather, I'm going to talk about some of this. And I found out that the lacrosse, these lacrosse ones, they mean a weather station. You know how you can buy your, your home little weather station? And some of the weather stations have internet capabilities or Wi-Fi capabilities, I should say. And they can get the data to your computer. But if, like myself, I don't have that. So the best one to use is going to be this last uh, selection here because we can get data from a website. So obviously to get data from the website, you're going to need internet connection to do it this way for the weather. Okay? You don't need internet connection for the time, but you're going to need it for the weather because it's got to pull the data off the uh, website. So we're going to select this and it pops off over here. This is the window that opens up. I got to make this bigger. We're going to show you here. We can tell it what we want to know, whether it's the outdoor temperature, wind speed, wind chill, precipitation. We can check those, but we got to get it from the website. Okay. And what you're going to do is you're going to add that. Once you figure out your uh, country, state, and, and whatnot, we've got to take that website address and add it to here. Okay? So what we're going to do, we're going to go to the website here. And I'll post a link to this website so you have it. And for my case, we're going to click here. And then I'm going to select just for the sake of a video I'm going to select um, this is the airport uh, they have weather station at the airport and we're going to select here we're going to pick let's just pick something here let's just pick uh, we'll just pick let's just pick Los Angeles okay Los Angeles airport now what we want to do We want to um, select, we have it on the weather here, and we want to make sure it does tell you the weather, the temperature. So now we're going to take the URL, which is right here, we're going to take that. And now we're going to put that into the program under favorites. And we're going to hit, we're going to paste that. If we did this right, we hit F1. It should. Downloading. See how it said downloading? Now we want to select weather. We want to select uh, wind just for this example. Okay. Now we're going to have this play. We can hit play. Let's uncheck the time. See if I got this. Hopefully you'll hear this in the, in the, I don't know if you'll hear this or not. Outdoor temperature, 19 degrees. Wind speed, none. See how you do that? Now if I want to time with it, I can select time. I want day. And, or actually we can probably go month and day we hit time is now if i hit play it's going to see the time and then the weather friday february 17 2023 time is 3 38 pm outdoor temperature 19 degrees wind speed none so there you go that's and you see i have it set so it refreshes every minute so it'll pull the info down here you saw it was said downloading and you can select you can change your units. So I want Fahrenheit, miles per hour, and inch. You want those. 
and we're going to change that. And then if you have this for every five minutes and this every, you know, maybe every minute, you don't need it to refresh, but you could set this for every 10 minutes. So when it says the time, it's going to go, it's going to give you your weather if you have it set for time. If you don't, like I said, just uncheck this and now it should just play the weather. Outdoor temperature, 66 degrees. Wind speed, none. This is obviously for Los Angeles, I believe is what I selected. So that's why it's, it's going to say a warmer weather. I'm just kind of showing you how to do that. So that's how you do it. Very simple. Let's go to that website and you select it. And you got to make sure you see the weather in here. Um, let's kind of move this up here a little bit. So you want to make sure you see the weather. If you're on the right page, it's to say the weather down here. And then just copy that URL like I just did. Outdoor temperature. 66 degrees wind speed none so you just copy that url after you select what you want whether you're in los angeles or whatever country as you saw and then you just cut and paste that into the program and now we can close this and that's all we got to do now if i need to re go in there i hit this one right here cwx and then now my favorites will have that web address. I can delete it, change it. Um, like I said, I have it set for every every you know minute, but we could, you know that might be a little uh, excessive. I'm not sure how often that web page um, updates. It might say on here how often it web uh, updates. I'm not sure if it does, but anyway, you'll you'll get the idea. So that's how you do the weather. Um, real simple, and it's you know free software. Um, so if you have any questions or comments, please post them down below and please subscribe. Thank you and have a good day.